What's up everybody and welcome back to Battle Royale episode 15. I was finally able to get into a game and we got Wandy Rodriguez on the mound. My opponent's got Ordisimer Despanier, I don't know, but he's also got Reggie Soccer, Manny Machado, Reggie Jackson, and Adrian Gonzalez. So looking at the records here, I played a bunch of offline, but he's 12 and 14, and I've been grinding to get some new players for my actual Diamond Dynasty team. First batter up, Wandy Rodriguez will sit him down on that slow changeup. Now Reggie Stalker, who somebody told me in the comments is Barry Bonds, and I thank him for that. I guess they don't have his rights or whatever, but he gets sat down on strikes as well. Leadoff batter, Kevin Poor, is going to rip that one into the left center field gap. Poor angle taken by my opponent, You're letting it roll to the wall and giving us room. To get a double as he gets that back in. 0-2 count to our next batter. Ralph Kiner, opposite field hit. We're sending Pilar around as we were running on contact. And he's going to get in there just ahead of the throw. Putting us on the board. 1-0. to nothing. And then Bryce Harper will ground into the 4-6-3 double play right here. Not how I wanted the first at bat to go with him. But two outs away. That one's going to be hit deep by Jose Abreu. It's going to get over the right fielder's head by a couple of feet and that will be our second double of the first inning bringing up our next batter and that's going to be a fastball up high as Kang will swing and miss on that but we put up one in the first inning that's always a huge one to get the lead right away 0-2 count look at the slow curveball right there as we get them swinging on that and Rodriguez's first pitch is actually that curveball and I can understand why it's nasty as we get in with the change up that time in the dirt so another two strikeouts that inning for Rodriguez has got four so far now very first batter up gets hit in the foot Dietrich will take his base on that one right there next pitch up Salvador Perez going yard deep over the center field and into the first couple rows giving us another two runs 3 nothing now, very next batter, hanging curveball, Starlin Castro with the contact swing, will be taking that one out of the park as well. We go back to back, top of the second inning, now Chris Melton will be coming in, as we're up 4 nothing. couldn't do any anything the rest of that inning. So 0-1 counter the first batter, that one's going to be hit deep into right field, and will be put away with the fly ball right there, or well, top of the third, my bad. I brought him in at the top of the second. Anyways, that one's ripped through for the first hit of the ball game in to left field right there. So a man on 0-2 count, swing and a miss on that high fastball. One out away from getting the first win, and that's a little pop-up into foul territory. Jose Abreu will advance over there, put that one away easily, as we're now 1-0 and with this new team. I don't need, I, I'm looking for 10 wins or above, so this is just one step of the way. I'm not taking it as a victory at all. We're just moving closer to a goal. We got Brad Peacock on the mound, our worst pitcher, only 69 overall. He's got Carlos Frias. Also, Josh Harrison, Freddie Freeman, Nick Swisher. I don't see any diamonds in his lineup, though. Maybe they're out of his bullpen. Not sure. He's only 1-0. and oh. So, he's played one game in all of Diamond Dynasty so far. And very first batter, we're sitting Lorenzo Cain down on that high fastball up and in. So, next batter up, 0-1 count. We left that right down the middle with Peacock. And that's gone over the tall wall and deep into those seats as he takes a 1-0 lead. Skip to the top of the second. Nobody did nothing after that. And finally, we get our first base runner. Ball four on a ball that was half in the zone. And Kang's going to rip that one into left field. He completely misplays that. He was right there, just stopped a bit early. But we'll be putting our runners on second and third off of that error. I'd say, I don't know if they gave him a hit. And then Perez is going to ground that one into the hole. Great backhanded play. But he's way too deep to throw Perez out in one run. will score. So it's a tie ball game. We're advanced to the runners. Take and strike. Three call there. So we got, there's two away. Now we're bringing in Brad Miller to pinch it. He can get a ground ball and be out of this inning. Very first pitch, that's what he gets. But his shortstop will boot the balls. That allows us to score the second run. And everybody safe. So Kevin Pillar is going to put that one up the middle. And two errors cost him big here. As we are going to put three up on the board. And quite possibly would have been four if my runner on second decided to advance. But we'll take it. Three runs so far. Oh, two. Or two away. Connor's going to rip that one deep. And it will be caught right on that little uh, angle in the uh, wall, I guess. But we're putting up three runs off of two uh, errors on his part, which really cost him. But he brings in Pat Neshek and uh, makes Abreu look silly. But so, bottom of the third, 
3-1 count, ground ball right into the shift. We're three outs away. Make that two away from our second victory. That's an easy ground ball. Meldon still pitching for us. One away. And that one's going to be ripped. Nice play by our second baseman. And throw that one on the run. So one last out. 0-1 count. Pitch inside is going to break the bat. Put that one back to the pitcher. Easy throw to first. And we're going to win this one. Going 2-0. and So far, Jung Ho Kong gets the um, a player of the game that time. So eight wins away from getting in a legend. Even though it's a lower legend, I will take it. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe for more content. Peace.